Around March time, we sort of heard rumblings of changes. It's not the year that I thought we were going to have. This has to happen. It was all about trying to land this thing, that this immovable object that was coming into land. There is always so much going on when you are making a game. It's never a dull moment, especially in those last few years. Things are happening at a million miles an hour anyway, but to kind of hear those rumbles of game shows being cancelled uh, or being online, and then the, the next show going, and then the next show, we really had to start to think differently about how we were going to make this game. The most important parts of game development are pre-production and then that final push. The final push is all about coming together as one and really putting the polish on it. And by working remotely, by working apart from the team, that was a real challenge. Creatively, it is harder. VO recording was the, probably the biggest change, like usually myself and uh, the, the audio director Jay would, would go down to the studios where we're recording and be present to be able to talk to the actor, to talk to the director, and to do that online is quite a challenge, you know, getting a person to come from, from A and go to B and do a thing is, is quite simple, but to, to, to get all those same people digitally connected in the correct way to get the best possible result, you know, was, uh, was quite a challenge. We are used to working closely together, especially in these last few months before you are shipping a game. So we've had to be really thoughtful about how we've shifted to, to work from home. Working from home threw up some challenges for the project but ultimately the kind of collaborative nature of the, the game anyway. We work remotely with a number of people. It's kind of a, a patchwork of, of different sounds and instruments and people weren't always available to come into studios so they would use their home recording setups and send us kind of the sounds that we required and then we'd kind of mix them into the theme. Luckily we still had the opportunity to record a lot of the musicians at air. The strings were all socially distanced and what actually ended up happening was, because of how they were set out, we kind of used more of the space of the hall. We ended up getting this really wide, beautiful sound, which I think works perfectly for the theme. You wanted change, adventure, and I gave them to you. So come on! The most difficult hurdle this year has been the multiplayer element and, and the online element. If you were in the office, you would literally be looking at four different monitors. You'd be sat there trying to, to see the differences in the experience between clients and hosts and, and that would really help you fully understand the changes that were needed and, and the iterations that were needed and all of the processes that we had in place. Just none of that was feasible anymore. There's no point feeling sorry for ourselves. There's still work to do. Moving into the kind of final push, we saw how good this game was becoming and we just wanted to uh, do it justice, really. So we didn't want not working together uh, hamper that. To really put the icing on the cake, you have to put in that extra effort. And I can't explain how the extra effort from the team to finish this off independently of one another, they've just done such an amazing job on it. There is such a connection with the community and we all feel so um, responsible for the, the, the final game. So yeah, making a AAA game from home, from everyone's dining rooms or sheds or every single different location you could think of under the sun to, to make this game has been a massive achievement. 
I'm sat in my hallway. I uh, currently work in my dining room. I have my two kids and my wife as well. I think this year it's been way more tangible that there is this supporting cast behind us. It's the game that I've had the most satisfaction making, probably the best people I've worked with on it, and the most fun doing it. Seeing all that thought and all that work that's gone into it and people getting it and loving it and being surprised and delighted. That's, uh, it's been a wild ride. I'm really, really proud of us and, and what we've been able to do. PlayStation.